to part 110 of the Male Hunter Baby Challenge, Season 2. And in this episode, Skinky to Thoden, Vlad, and Zev age up. Another Zev and 769 are born. And also Stan's next girlfriend is Mermaid Laika. Anyways, I just want to talk about... Um, I just finished... Um, rec- uh, pre-recording episodes for the season two of the Male Hunter Baby Challenge. That's right. The fourth generation is finished. Okay, it all depends on when I'm gonna be able to put up these videos. Okay, let me know if whenever you want to see these videos. Okay, if you want to. Anyways, um. There are videos already done, edited. I mean, had to be converted from A ABI to MP4. So that's done. They just need commentary. So that's pretty much it. You know, I'm taking a break from pre-recording episodes. I still haven't recorded episode one thirty for Super Sim Challenge, which is the finale episode, and it's basically going to have Prince testing out all the magic abilities so there's that anyways when i was doing prints i mean not that way what i mean is um the the this this season finale of the male hunter baby challenge with stan he and some random witch or spellcaster uh, created the prodigy for season three of the Male Hunter Baby Challenge, which is prints. And let me tell you something about creating prints using Stan's jeans. It does not look exactly like prints from the Super Saiyan Challenge. I mean, he looks sort of different. It's what you expect when you mix in Stan's jeans. I mean, it was a risk I was taking. So, there's that. Thank you, Train. I needed that. Anyways. I'm trying to get as many videos with commentary as much as possible uploaded. Let's see what we got here in my upload list. I got some Hungry Shark videos, some Hungry Dragon videos. Uh, I can upload... As I'm recording this, this is the 6th... No, this is the 7th. I'm recording the, this commentary on October 7th. And for October 8th, I'm going to be uploading episodes 19, 20, and 21 of Hungry Shark. So there's that. And if I get to hungry, but if I get to hungry shark videos, I could upload 37, 38, 39, but then 40 needs commentary. Of course, I pick a video that does not have audio. <sighs> Do I have to? I'm already doing commentary for these for the ser this series. And I'm going to be doing commentary for Super Sim and Rags and Riches. I want to finish Super Sim this month. Okay? I'll finish the thir this generation here this month. But I won't be putting up videos for the fourth generation until later. Third, the third season. Don't know when I'll be able to put that. I haven't even started recording that yet. I'm taking a break here. I don't want to burn myself out. I also want to do Whims Only Challenge with Jigarata. Um, I still got to do the final Generation Zev in the second season of the Hunter of the Hunter Baby Challenge with Zev. I got to finish that. There's just a lot to do. I also want to do another season with Zev, but not a Hunter Baby Challenge. Okay, I want to do like a Survivor series, you know, like the episode Survivor. But they do have a they do have a challenge called the Bachelor or Bachelorette challenge, which will what I'll use for the Survivor challenge. So I gotta look up the rules. Whatever. 
Also, for the Season 3 of the Male Hunter Baby Challenge, that you should cheat to make Prince all-powerful. He's not starting from the beginning. I did that with Super Sim Challenge. I started Prince from the beginning of uh, Spellcaster. So, I rank, so Prince is at his final rank. He's all-powerful. He knows all the spells, all, the, all that stuff. So... So, Prince is not somebody you really, really, really want to mess with. I know cheating. It's not like he's immortal. They're we doing four generations. Only the first generation Prince is powerful. You know how much damage he can do as a spellcaster? You will see. So, in Super Sam 130, is, we're testing all... Of the skills. Why did you put the kid way over there? How that even work? You stretch your arms like you're... Uh, what is that, what's that guy's name? In Mr. F is it Mr. Fantastic? The guy in Fantastic Four that can stretch? Is it Mr. Fantastic or something? I don't know. Anyways. That's what it looked like. What's what, that's what it looked like. What happened when he stretched his arms to put the kid in the, other, the opposite side of him. Zev, I know it's confusing to have Zevs and the two Zevs in the same room spelt the same, but the kid Zev is not going to look like Zev because we're not doing the Zev Hunter Baby Challenge here. So I meant to look, we're not going to confuse everybody if they all look the same. That's for the Zev Hunter Baby Challenge. Also, Season 3 is a different file save. Um... This YouTuber, Plumbella, she has another. She has made a file save of most of the worlds. I mean, she's renovated most of the worlds, and um, and I'm using that save, putting down some of my own builds, basically my Lex houses, and having my Sims live there. And here's the thing: the only people I moved over. From from the fourth generation to the new save file is Stan with his last girlfriend and the last, I think it's last five kids that were born in that generation. And that's it. I saved them and moved them over to this generation. And then I moved Prince out to his home house. He's going to live in... The Magical Lex build that I built on a 40 by 30 lot in Glimmerbrook. And that's where Prince is going to live. Glimmerbrook. And the second generation, I want him, he's going to live in, I don't know, I think I'm going to make him live in the, wait, he's going to be a vampire. It really doesn't matter. He's going to be a powerful vampire too. I'm not going to, sorry, I'm cheating that too. I don't care. I want him to go out in the sun and stuff. I He's going to be a powerful vampire, too. Anyways. Gotta have some food. Can mermaids eat lobster? I know they can't eat fish. They get sick when they eat fish. But do they get sick eating lobster? Or shrimp? I don't know. It's just the question. I don't know. I don't get it. It's like 40 degrees outside, and yet I'm inside. I'm freaking hot. I don't know if it has something to do with the heat being on, because usually when the heat's on, I don't usually feel it when I'm sitting at my desk, and I'm cold. But yet I'm cold. I'm not cold at all. I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm burning up, and I need to plug in the... I feel like I need to plug in the air conditioner. I'm sure Frank's probably burning up in the in his room. He got the heater on. I close, close the door. I don't want him to suffocate. So I'm, I'm gonna do that. Oh, that's much better. I'm burning up. I'm wearing, I'm wearing, I'm wearing sweats and long sleeve shirt and a t-shirt over that. I'm burning up here. 
and it's like 40s outside. Oh, and that air feels really good right now. <laughs> I have to tell you. I look 40 degrees outside, and yet I go in my room, and I'm going to go to bed, and I'm going to turn on the fan, and it feel mu- and it feel really good. She's a mermaid, and we're going to show off her mermaid tail. This is... The other mermaid's head? Yeah. She has a nice tail. I like mermaid tails. I don't mess with mermaids much in the next generation. Like when my sims are mermaids, either mermaids or spellcasters. I don't mess with them. I don't edit them. Because even if I do edit them, something goes, something messes up when I exit out of create a sim. So, something messes up and they, my sims glitch out or something. Something's glitchy about them. I don't know. So, I don't, I don't mess with that much in the next generation. The only swimming, mer, mer, the only mermaid you're going to see swimming around is, is Stan, okay? Fourth generation Stan is going to be a mermaid. He may be wearing blue, but he's, when he's a mermaid, he's red. He's got a red tail, his skin's red, he's got red horns. It's gonna look pretty cool. But when he's in his human form, he's wearing blue. He's in the skin's not blue, he looks like a regular human, but he's wearing blue. Here's why I put him in blue. One, first generation Stan's already wearing red. Second generation is wearing white because he looks like the Stan in white when he's on the beach in during the beach episode. St- Stan sees himself in white. There's the white Stan. Second generation, st- third generation Stan is wearing red, but he's an alien. Fourth generation Stan, he's not wearing. He's wearing blue, but he but he's a red mermaid. Um. Let me see. I'm thinking. And when I... When the song Blue came out by Apple 65, when it first came out and I first heard it, the first person that came to my mind singing it was Stanley Tweedle. And I can picture him wearing blue. It's like his, his same uniform he's wearing red, but it's blue. We got another mermaid here. Alright, let me keep up with the times here. What am I looking at? Okay. Did I, okay, here we go. Um Thoden and Vlad. So that's Thoden. Yeah, Thoden and Vlad. Yeah. Skinkita aged up too. Or Skinkita and Thoden. No, Skinkita and Thoden. Vlad and Zed are children. What am I going through? What am I looking at? <laughs> I read this. I'm going down the list. It, Okay, Skinkita and Thoden, okay? That's who I'm looking at. This is Thoden. We're almost done here, people. I mean, think about it. We're almost done. If. Zeb and 769 will be born. That means we got three more kids to go. Three more. This generation, by the end of this episode, we're going to be at, at kid 22 for this generation. But if you go by all generations, that's episode. That's kids number 71 and 72. If, if all in total, you know. This is interesting. Also, the third season starting off kind of fresh because I'm not going to have my sim get contacted a million times since, since, since somebody died. 
we're not going to see all his relatives die or hear about it. All of Prince's aunts and uncles dying. We're not going to hear our brothers and sisters dying of old age. We're not going to hear that. Because we're on the new different save file. <laughs> we're not going to have my Prince sad all the freaking time. Uh-uh. No more of that crap. I mean, it's okay to be sad, but... I mean, if you, if you can't... If you're doing a Hunter Baby Challenge... If you got a nickel for every time a rel- one of your Sims relatives died... You'd be rich. Here we go. Oh. Seven, seven, sixty-nine. Kids. Twenty-one and twenty-two. And of course, the other two moved out. Skin Keat and Thode moved out. We are ready for the last three kids to be born. We also got five episodes left of this generation. Five. So that's awesome. I can't wait to get them done, to be honest. I'll get them out when I get them out. Plain and simple. I know it's a bit confusing to have a Zev give birth to a Zev and Zev give birth to a Zev. <laughs> I know that's I know that's messed up. I know it's kind of weird. Aww, these little babies are so cute. We know that this Zev here. That Zebia Vertu is an alien because I remember recording this. I recorded this one. She's an alien. And he's a mermaid, I think. 769, I think, is a mermaid. Hold on, I'm gonna look. Not the fourth generation. Okay. Zeb is uh, an alien. This is Zev here that's just been born. And Zev 69 is a mermaid. Cool. Anyways. Third season. Sorcerer Prince is going to hook up with vampires. I already made Lex Crew into vampires. I know I did a video. I did a video that you will see around Halloween um, of a vampire character cast video along with the medieval build too and that's going to go up as well. And you know it shows Prince. I turned Prince into a vampire. Here's what I did. I placed the Lex characters, characters in, this, in the save file that I plan on using for season 3. I went in the cast no, here's what I did. I went into play mode, gameplay mode, into live mode, and used MC Command Center to turn them all into vampires, and also used it, MC Command Center, to give them vampire points and to, or, or to rank them up, whatever, and give them trait, give vampire traits. That's why I did all of them. And then I went in the cast. And change how they, and change their dark form and whatever. Of course, I added Vlad in there too. Remember Vlad from yeah season four? Vlad, who was Ka- Kai's nemesis from episode what well, Purgus Night? Episode Vlad, Magic Baby, and Stan killed her with a magic stick given him by Druids. That was awesome. Anyways. Here we got Mermaid Laika. He's not going to marry Laika because the first generation Stan did that. Who do you think is left? Come on, there's two Mermaid Lex characters left. 
Okay, who do you think they are? Who, do, who have I not used? Tell me. I, I want you all to guess, okay? I want you to guess on who have I not used yet. Anyways, I was just got done watching some legs. I was watching some season four. I watched um, Prime Rins, uh, Mort and Moss, and Dutch Tree. And I was like, I was like watching Mort, and it was funny when Mort uh, is that there's a told Stan and Zed that there's a viewing and <laughs> and the you know ask questions to the grieving family and, and it was funny <laughs> I don't know man the question Stan was asking was funny I just felt like watching Lex, okay? I mean, there are certain episodes I feel, feel just feel like watching, okay? I'm like, oh, I feel like watching this right now. I'm gonna watch it. <laughs> I'm gonna watch this episode, okay? I feel, I'm gonna. I mostly try to avoid watching Yo A O because the series finale episode always makes me cry, and I try to avoid sadness, okay? I'm 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 really trying to avoid it. Good, she's pregnant. Go tell Stan the good news. Talk like a pirate day. Did we just have that? Did we just have that? I could have sworn we had talk like a pirate day already. We have another talk like a pirate day. Did we have that episode? Did you all remember me doing that episode where talk like a pirate day? Didn't you all remember me doing that episode? Because I remember doing that episode. I don't remember what number episode, but I remember just doing that. I was in the 90s or something episode. Oh my gosh. Or in the 80s. 80s or 90s episode. Anyways, the end of this video. Stay tuned for part 111. Uh, we got Stan working on skills and goes to the, and he goes to the flea market. So stay tuned for part 111.